Annie Pacquiao versus uh, Golovkin. Um, I was watching, um, I was going through YouTube, this video fucking popped up, and I think uh, it was Dan's the network, and they were interviewing like Freddie Roach. I didn't fucking, I didn't watch all of it. All of, the talents caught, caught my eye. Manny Pacquiao versus um, Golovkin. It could happen. I was like, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, how the fuck's this fight gonna happen? How is Manny Pacquiao gonna? He's gonna have to, I think, move two weight classes, isn't he, to fight Golovkin? I just, I don't see it happening. I don't see Pacquiao moving two weight classes. I think he's moved up, is it eight different divisions now, isn't it? So, <laughs> It's impossible. I don't. I don't think it's gonna happen. The only way it happens is um, if he, um, if Pacquiao drains um, Golovkin and um, makes him fight at one fifty four. That's the only chance. You know, he'll probably fight at one fifty four, and he will uh, add some rehydration clauses in there. Um, yeah, it'll be a catch weight one fifty four. Um, then add rehydration clothes so he can't cool off and can't come in um, too big into the fight. He's basically gonna be drained. Um, that's the only chance Pacquiao's got. If he moves up two weight classes, fights Golovkin, there's no rehydration clothes, nothing. He's gonna get he'll get beat, won't he? Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, there's there's weight classes for a reason, isn't it? You know, I know you know people will be saying, Oh but he, they say the same thing about De La Hoya said the same thing about fucking Margarito, I mean, Koto, but um, he fought Koto, it was a 147 fight, he fought in 145, do you know what I mean? <laughs> it's still, you know what I mean, it's still drained him, it's not even drained him, I, I know Koto agreed to a 145, either way, why is he fighting 147, what difference does it make? Um, Margarito, yeah, he beat Margarito, but Margarito was a 140, 7.5 anyway, wasn't he? And he fought him at 150, didn't he? I know he moved, I'm sure Margarito moved up, I can't remember. So they had a catch, they had to fight at 150. But yes, Margarito is a big guy, but you know, he's, let's be real, he, he's a bum, isn't he? Um, no, he's a bum, but like, he, the size difference in terms of the weight wasn't. Can I, was it that? He's <laughs> it's, it's basically not Golovkin. Like I said, Golovkin is heavier than more great, isn't he? He might not be. I think it's similar height, but he's definitely, in terms of his frame, he's heavier. Um, also, people talk about De La Hoya. He fought De La Hoya, but he drained him, didn't he? he fucking made him come down to 147. Where I don't think De La Hoya fought him in about 10 years. <laughs> he fought him 147. They had a re like rehydration clause where he couldn't like come in like he, basically he's a walking fucking skeleton. Do you know what I mean? He just beat him and they beat him down. He still got the win, whatever. But you know he he drained him, didn't he? Let's let's be you know let's be real. Like, anybody would have beat Delahoya that day. He's just he's, he was done, wasn't he? he was just fucking gone and everything. So can I see this fight happening? I mean, no, it can happen, but it'll have to be. It'll have to be a fucking catchway at one fifty four. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> or some shit like that. You'll have to fight, yeah, one fifty four. Or, or something like that. I don't see him going up to one sixty and fighting um, Golovkin. I don't see it. I don't know if you guys think he'll do it then just comment below tell him like let me know is it do you think Pacquiao will fight Golovkin and do you think um, um he can beat him like a 160 I don't think he can like I said the only <laughs> he can't fight in 160 he'll have to fight in 154 or some shit or 155 whatever I don't know how how, how it works um but he ain't beating Golovkin Okay, that's 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 all I know. If he finds somebody's way, he won't, he's not beating him. Only chance is catch weight and like 
all these rehydration clauses, whatever they fucking do. It's basically so, just to make it, <laughs> he's, he's too big. That's my reason, he's just too big. Um, I don't see him, I don't fucking see him fighting a lot. He's stupid, he's got, he's got fighters he can fight at 147. Like Errol Spence, he's got a better chance of beating. Or uh, Crawford's probably, I think, is probably a tougher matchup for Pacquiao. But you know, he's probably got a better chance of beating them than moving up and fighting Golovkin. Like I said, there's, you know, there's weight classes for a reason. I just don't fucking, I don't see it happening. I, I really don't. Um, I was talking about a UFC fight with Jones and. Um, in Ghana, and that's probably more likely to happen than this fight. Do you know what I mean? Um, but whatever, I mean, if Golovkin, you know, is looking for payout, like a payday, then he, he he'll have to sacrifice some. Um, he'll have to sacrifice in those, those negotiations. He's gonna have to move down. There's no way Pacquiao's moving up to fight him. I just don't see it.